The A-Star Science Jubilee at One North is one of the events under the Science at 50 initiative to celebrate 50 years of Singapore's innovation through science and technology. The Science Jubilee at One North seeks to showcase the success of One North as a hub for research and innovation and the diversity of the public and private research activities in Singapore. Uh, it's pretty interesting, like you can see uh, what are the different research they are doing, so we can know a lot more about all the different institutes within Biopolis. The most interesting one would be the, the lab tour. You, know, you can see a lot of things that normally for the public we won't be able to see. So I think that's uh, a very good eye-opener for, for, for me and also for my, for my son. I think it's a great opportunity for ASTAR to showcase their uh, science, their activities to the general audience. Well, one of the reasons that we like to do these science shows is that we want to make the young kids aware of chemistry and physics that they normally don't see. ISIS is showcasing today on inhaled aerosol uh, drug delivery. Today's event is a very good platform to share with the public what we do at ASTAR. And I'm very happy to see the large crowds uh, visiting our stores. I think everyone is enjoying themselves. Oh, I think it's very interesting because you, you don't normally get a chance to, to see um, all the science projects and learn about it unless you are really reading the newspapers all the time about our innovation. And the children had a lot of fun to find out that a lot of things are actually like um, invented in Singapore. And it's, um, I hope it sparks their interest in science. What we are showing here today is different stages of development of the zebrafish. One of the interesting things about this fish is its embryos are mostly transparent. Science Jubilee at One North is the kind of events we should have more often. It allows the public, especially the young children who are here, to see what we are doing in the lab and at the same time for us to reach out and them to see how the scientists are uh, doing their research.